she can't get out, can she? In San Rafael, California, this woman is angry at a moving crew. Muggy! Look at that! Are you fucking kidding me? Yes, she just called the African-American driver a monkey. I can't even <laughs> walk between this. I could. Uh, yes, the moving guy is thinner than she is. You know what? <laughs> what Watch is out. with you? What's Our wrong with you? Needs to go to work. Okay. Get the truck now. You're holding me up. Uh, sorry, SA, the garbage man. Move it right now. Get in that truck. The woman with the lovely forearm tattoos has not yet been identified. On TikTok, she's being called Racist Karen. And this video is going viral. The comments include, uh, they always out, gotta resort she? to racism. Monkey. The way she said Look monkey was like she's been waiting her whole life to say it. That was filled with hate. Sad to say there are still what? people out here like this. <laughs> Watch <laughs> out. Mm. Crazy, right? Well, there are a couple more things about this video that make it even more insane. Hello, everybody. I'm David Schuster, and thanks for joining us. San Rafael, California, where this happened, this is in Marin County. It's in Northern California in the Bay Area. It's on the north side of the Golden Gate Bridge. It is literally one of the most beautiful counties in the United States. The weather is gorgeous, literally perfect in terms of trying to stay calm. And it looks like, based on this video, it was a typical day in Marin County. 60 degrees, blue skies, maybe a slight breeze. If there's ever a place to be able to stay calm, this is it. Secondly, this was not an 18-wheeler moving truck. This was something a little bit smaller. In other words, there could have been plenty of opportunity, more opportunity for mobility with this truck in terms of moving around than if it was a much bigger truck. Now, you don't have to be happy if somebody's blocking you in or it seems like you're stuck, but the woman could have easily just said, hey, please move your truck, you're blocking me in, or you're blocking my relative in. It doesn't, again, she doesn't have to smile about it. She just could have said, just move your truck. And it looks like, you know, the guys would have been fine. They would have moved and that would have been it. But to go crazy and all racist on them? Uh, she can't get out, can she? Muggy! Look at that! Are you fucking kidding me? I can't even <laughs> walk between this. I could. You know what? <laughs> what Watch is out. with you? What? Now, kudos to the moving crew for how calm they stayed in the face of this woman's crazy racism. And it was actually pretty funny and witty how quickly they came back with when she said about the amount of space. And the guy said, well, I could have fit there, pointing out the difference in terms of the amount of space that she occupied as opposed to them. I'm not sure I would have gone there, but I'll leave it up to the comment section. I think this woman certainly deserved that. In any case, this particular racist Karen has not yet been identified, but I'm sure the internet will do its job. And before too long, she will be publicly humiliated and shamed. She might even lose her job, whatever her job is. And then she'll have plenty of time to think about and to patrol the streets of her neighborhood in Marin County and stop all the moving trucks from parking too close to other cars and be the official police in terms of how much space people can occupy. Remarkable. Keep those cameras rolling.